Kyle's here again for episode 6 of my Master Date series. I'm here again with the lovely Alan. We'll be master dating with him today. Alan wrote a lot of the dialogue for the game, the really stupid dialogue. How are you, Alan? I'm fine, thanks, Kitty. How are you? I'm wonderful. Okay. What, what are we going to look at today, Alan? We're going to be looking at some achievements. Yes. We're going to be going into a bit more detail about the recent updates. Yes. And we're going to be going on a couple of dates. Oh, very nice. Okay. Should we have a look in the letterbox? Yeah, well, we've got some posts, so... Let's have a look. Flynn Overwrite. Oh, dear. I'm afraid Jennifer and I have decided to go our separate ways. They didn't have very much in common. He did at least like her fondness for canapes. She liked his foreign films. But she, her jet skiing was just too much to ask. He did lie a little bit as well. So it's all, you know, it's all, it's all his own fault. Not ours. <laughs> <laughs> it's never our fault. It's never our fault. <laughs> Oi, Kitty, I had to give Nicholas... Oh, no, it's a woman. Oi, Kitty, I had to give Nicholas the boot because I didn't really fancy him that much. I suppose <laughs> I liked something about Nicholas. Mainly his interest in brainstorming, but his preoccupation with smartphones really got on my nose. I maybe told a porky or two, but nothing major. Don't know why I bothered, really. I'm feeling a bit down about it now, but I think I'll be OK. Sincerely, Catherine. Now, this was the one that we did... Uh, that was... Businessman, isn't that it? That was the businessman. Yes, because she was a hippie, couple. and he was... Yeah, well, no cheap. wonder, yeah. It's pretty unlikely that... A oh, dear, of, we've uh, got a poor reputation again, Alan. We're not really master daters, are we? Well, we're experimental. We're on the cutting edge. We of are. We are. Get, in fact, we're sacrificing our reputation and to show you. Experimentation <laughs> leads to many that's failures. That's right. That's right. That's what we tell all the customers. Let's have a look at the achievements, shall we? See which ones we're going to get. So we've got best of British. These are all the restauranty ones. I've got quite a lot of the Chinese restaurant ones. <clears throat> well, you've got six. The food. So. Yes, six. Well, that's more than I've got in anything else. We did Friends with Benefits We've the other day. We've been walked out four times. But we could deliberately lose some. Yeah, but that's... But there's we, not really we'll more gain dating, more by it? winning. We could click the cat Ooh, if it appears. Pretty galore, yeah. Fifteen more times for the cats. One of these days we need to do Schadenfreude, which is quite a complicated one. We have to fail every minigame. In the funniest way. Although the funniest way only really applies to one or two of the mini games where there's multiple outcomes. If there's more than two outcomes, that's why it says the funniest way, because usually one of them is funnier, isn't it? Like the one where you fail to lie to the X and the X comes back and says you left your underwear in there in the washing machine or yeah. something. That's the worst possible outcome. Spoilers. No, it's the funniest possible outcome. Probably the worst as well. Probably, because, you know, that's why it's called Schadenfreude. Anyway, we've done Coffee Run and we've done Businessman, but we could do another one of those. So we could do Erm and Everyone gets titled on their first date anyway. Inappropriate touching. Yeah, we'll have a go at that. We'll have a go at that. We've only got 13 babies, so, you know, we've been overtaken by a lot. Pants on Fire. What was the Pants on Fire one? Pants on Fire is to spin the Wheel of Misfortune four times in one date and Ooh, pair the couple off. That's a lot of lying. That is a lot of lying. We don't encourage lying here. Well, not very often anyway. Only in a pinch. Right, let's get on with it. So which of those... Uh, well, we'll have to look at our characters, won't we? We will, we will. Which achievement we're going to go for. Yes, that's right. So, we've got three choices. We have Neve. She is a used car salesperson and she's looking for a woman. Elise is a taxi driver and she's looking for a man. And Jaden is a database administrator and he's looking for a woman. Oh, what about the gay pride achievement? Well, let's go for the lesbian then. Shall we do that? Yeah, because, well, we, did you notice how many I didn't even see gay pride achievement on the list? It was there. Was it? I didn't see what the, how many you'd done Well, let's so have far. a look at it next time we're in that screen. Yes. Not now. No, not now. My name's Neve. I'm going to skip <clears throat> to the end. That's a funny spelling, isn't it? It's not how you'd expect That's Neve That's because it's be Welsh. Spelling. I've got a Welsh friend called Neve. She's practical. There are other... There, you can see there, we've got the practical icon added in the last update. What is the achievement for a practical? Oh, that's true. It's practical, isn't it? Practical and what? 
So what we need to get the uh, to get the opposite subtract achievement is an arty person because it's the dungaree jamboree achievement. So she looks arty, doesn't she? She look? could well be. Yeah, she's. She, I. I'm pretty, pretty sure money she's on it. Should we actually spend some money? Yeah, because we show off the new feature of being Bing. able to... Ooh, she's arty, look at that! Oh my go. God. And what is her occupation and affluence level? Her occupation is personal assistant. Oh, she be nice and easy. easy. She's nice and easy. Brilliant. Right, let's do it. Are you sure? Yes. Right, now, we've already talked about the envelopes in the last episode, so let's carry on. Where are we going anyway? Should we go for Indian? Well, you mean that they move more slowly now? Yes, they do move slightly more slowly. Indian. For people like me. The spice is right. My tummy's rumbling just thinking about it. I love Indian food. So do I. Right then, let's have a look at the salon, the new salon. Oh quickly. yes, because we didn't really look at them. She likes pink hair, time. so we're going to get her some pink hair. You can see the pink hair is now very easily selectable when you want it with just one click, kittens. Thing. <laughs> now we don't really need to do this because um, we're going to keep we our job, but we need to show everyone. We will get a bonus for that with no risk, but there's no point in changing the style because if we talk about them, they're going to disagree anyway. Well, outfits. let's have a look at these anyway, yes, that's let's a good check idea. It out so because... now we've got practical style. These are all practical, and if we do this, they're all going to be either liked or loved, usually loved by that type. So it's much easier for you to choose which one you want. Yeah, they are. If you wanted to make it look arty, we just go in there, click on arty, and now these are all arty styles Can't that arty wrong. people will like or love. So it makes it much easier. Same in here, practical people will like these rather subtle shades of makeup. <laughs> and some not so subtle. And then if we go to glam, they're all a bit more colourful. The least subtle. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Anyway, oh, with outfits. Outfits is cool. Look, this is practical people. Yeah, oh, so they're all practical, practical outfits. Aren't they? Yes. <laughs> And then <laughs> I'm good with me hands. I'm good with me hands at all. Then we could glam look, glamorous Ooh, girls. Glamorous, Ooh, glamorous glamour. outfits. Sequins and fake fur, ribbons. What else have we got? Hipsters, they're very colourful. And they're like crazy combinations. <laughs> anyway, let's stop patronising people and carry on, shall we? <laughs> If it's all getting too confusing, you can just pay to see candidates type in the black book. But just like me, it's not cheap. <laughs> Ooh, I calculate my dates here already. <laughs> Greetings, fellow human. I just admire you, Elsie. Oh, look, they've got matching speech types. Oh, well, they're matching, correct. I would therefore suggest you must be Neve. You're the only person that would know that, Alan. Really? Yeah, because you wrote them. <laughs> oh. It's gratifying to make your acquaintance. So I did. Come on, Lisa, she's impressed by the restaurant. Ocular Hogan. Or, <laughs> or, <laughs> or, your ocular organs are a pleasing hue. Yeah, see, I've got you to say one of the lines. Eyes, one of the least erogenous zones in the human body. No. She likes her hair colour. Oh, oh, that's good. That's paid for her uh, hair, hair change. Good evening, are you ready to order? Affirmative. What's your preferred sustenance? Cold no meat dish. Right, she's vegetarian. What do we want? Kachumba. Cold no meat, kachumba. Kachumba. Should we pay for it? Start well, collecting. We, we do need actually to start collecting those yes. menu items, but it's going to be expensive. Have we, we've got all the restaurants now, haven't we? Yes, so, you have. Have we got, got all the Black Book pages? I think we have, haven't we? You've probably unlocked everything else, to be honest. So, But it depends whether you want to keep afloat or not. You know, a bit, a little bit of money in reserve in case you need to splash out. Two portions of kachumba, please. Oh, yes, you like that. A little bit of salad. Basically, you don't <laughs> want to completely leave yourself flat broke because you need a bit of emergency money. Anyway... Right, we know something about him. Well, they Her. don't match on either of those two, so you may as well go for a different one, activity. Right, because it's always worth activity. uncovering personality traits, because that gives you a 
I think practically we've Lara actually usually active, although she is an avatar character. So. Yes, yes. Do you want a high maintenance <laughs> garden or a patio with a hot tub? Let me think about that. A oh, high maintenance so. garden. Yes. I thought so. Definitely a high maintenance garden. Anyone that would describe themselves as practical? Oh no, she's arty, isn't she? She's arty. Oh. She's not practical. We're I'm, both I'm, 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 I'm completely confused now. She's arty and she's. Practical. It's because doing the opposites is against my usual programming. Does not compute. It doesn't compute, so I always assume they're the same because I'm so good at detecting people's type. Um. No, well, we don't want to do guilty pleasures because we'll be in trouble. Yeah, because it's the first date. You must never talk about them on a first date. We could. We'll, have to, we we'll have to nudge. It? We've got no option but to nudge. Do we, we? We didn't change her hair, did we? No, but she might like it. Can't do it's, outfits. It's, no. Well, don't know. Should we she's, do facial decor? She's only wearing a t-shirt. What kind of makeup has she got? Don't know. Oh dear. We have to remember. All right, go on. Let's take a risk Let's on... Let's take a risk on facial decor. Oh, she'll like it. She Have you any thoughts like on it. my clear complexion? I've no opinion either way. Oh. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> and my clear complexion. It's by far the best I've ever seen. Ever! <laughs> now, that the reason for that is because this is an avatar letter. I mean, an avatar character. So, right. she's been selected by somebody real. She hasn't been driven by the procedural system that generates arty people. She wouldn't have had clear complexion, I don't think. So an arty person that is generated... But practical people love clear complexions because they're, they're no nonsense. Yeah. They don't well, that's all right. We got through that little game. Anyway, we're just trying to explain because we're master daters, trying to help people. Don't be shy. Slap on the slap! <laughs> oh, it's the ex. Hi, my name. How are you? Oh, it's my partner. Ex-partner. It was this interloper. I am rational and logical as per usual. How are you? I'm great, thanks. Well, nice to see you. Got to go. Bye. I'm in agreement with that sentiment. Goodbye. <laughs> you going to describe your relationship to that person? Now we don't know. We don't know. Do you reckon Artie? She's an Artie. She's probably spicy. So she might be alright yeah, with it. Yeah, but it's an avatar character, so it could be oh, either. Oh, that's true. So you may as well just tell the truth. If you don't know, tell the truth. It's the X. Why not? Oh, oh no. no! She's romantic. She's romantic. They appear to be irrationally disgruntled. <laughs> Blimey, we need to calm them down. Oh, even later that evening. Time to pull the love handle. Ding. Occupation. Um. Well, PA. She like PA, mm. weren't they? Practical. Should do it. Let's just or or she'd probably be. Please tell me your occupation, Elsie. I'm presently occupied as a personal assistant. She'll be, um, yeah, it's mess. She didn't care. Should we, should we try lying? Um, I don't think we're going to have much trouble. No. I think they're all right. Can lie for a bit of fun? Just lie, lie for just a bit of fun. Casual lying? No. Entertaining. Lying purely for Fibbing amusement. Fibbing white lies. Well, we got away with it, so that's lies. lucky. Did we get away with it, though? Yes, yeah, we did. Yes. Oh, how incredibly impressive. Gratitudes. I thoroughly enjoy my work. You're going to reveal your occupation, Neve? Oh dear, I hope she lies. Oh no, should we lie again? Well, we could do Celebrity so Socialite. Or Alien <laughs> Abductee. Yeah, I'm an alien abductee. I'm a Celebrity Socialite in my rather drab looking V-neck jumper. Oh no, it's going to go wrong. We can always cheat. Oh no! Cheating is purely at the discretion of the player, by the way. Nothing to do with me. Right, come on. We really need to win this. Yes, we need to. We, oh uh, oh we, no! Uh, yes, I think everything will be alright! Oh my goodness, no! no. Oh dear. <laughs> that went oh, they're not convinced! Oh dear, that went completely Currently wrong. employed as a celebrity socialite. I suspect they're telling lies <laughs> yeah. based on that hideous outfit. Yeah. <laughs> Here is your bill. I hope everything was to your satisfaction. What amount should we tip the restaurant employee? Twelve percent. Twelve percent. Oh, that's quite tricky. So that's two fifty-eight plus about five fifty p. It's more like two fifty-nine. Two fifty-nine, and then two percent of that is fifty p. So it's three o nine. Three o nine or three eleven. Three eleven. Yeah. Here's the agreed monetary bonus. <laughs> Excellent. You're extremely intelligent. 
My brain's functioning at normal levels for a genius. It's time for us to leave the restaurant. We should depart now. Away with ye. I find them relatively attractive. Yeah, it's relatively attractive. Oh, that, what does that mean? Does that mean we should go in for the kill? It means as long as the other one is... She should be all right. She seemed fairly She's impressed. She did lie once, though, we, and get we caught. We got caught lying once. But she was impressed by the restaurant. Everything else, I think, will outweigh that. Let's go for it. Yeah. Would you be my significant other? Mm. Affirmative. That'd be super optimal. Excitement overload. <gasps> yes. Okay, we love the hot tub. We always like to see the hot tub. And that should mean... Ding! Dungaree Germany. We've got the achievement. Right. 80 coins. Got a reasonable bit of money. A little bit of promotion points. Yeah. But we should get a reputation. We've got up a reputation level. That's actually the reason why, why the reputation level down. is there. Is because when your reputation is poor and you're not playing very well, it makes the game a little bit easier. So you won't get any yeah. VIPs or anything when you've got a poor reputation. Yeah. It all balances out. Yeah, it's a balancing... Balancing. Mechanic. Isn't it? <laughs> Isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Right, so we'll try and get the Chinese restaurant next. Where's the gay pride one? Gay pride. How many gays have you paid off? There, 23. 23. Mm, well, we've well, just done one, so we could do a gay couple. Inappro inappropriate touching. You've only done 157. That's a lot of t poking. Yeah, but we can edit it. Ego, a go, go. Right, okay, let's just get on with it, shall we? Yes. Right. Let's carry on. This game is a dating roguelike. No, I don't know what it means either. <coughs> I actually do know what it means. Yeah, I knew you I knew probably I've maybe. actually bought a few roguelikes. I find them very appealing. Like chocolates. <laughs> <laughs> this is a game is a dating roguelike. Hi, I'm Elise. I'm a taxi driver. I'm looking for a man. What do we think they are? Because we've only got a few people in the... These are both straight people as well. Should we pay for the phone? It's a lot Should of we... money... We might as well take one of them on a date and then... It's not that much money. 50 coins, you We know. could be buying restaurant things for that, though, couldn't yes, we? Yes, exactly. All right, let's... Well, we've got Coffee Runner. He looks sporty, so let's do her. Coffee run, And she looks we to me... We can always boot her out again anyway. That's true. She's a hippie. hippie. But we've done hippie, haven't we? Yeah, we have. What was hippie? Oh, yeah, businessman. We've done hippie. And he's sporty. It's not you, woman. Go and wait in the lobby. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> right. Let's see what he is. He's sporty. We done. We've done, we've done coffee sporty, run as well. Yeah. No. no. Never mind. All right. We're going to be nice and take her. Oh, sorry, darling. We got you mixed up. Come in. Yeah. We didn't mean it. We didn't mean it. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. So we're looking for an actual hippie now, are we? Somebody make her a coffee. Did you do play it? That's Kieran. Oh, oh yeah. Maybe. We He's not a hippie. He'll he be... looks like a total hippie. Yeah, but he's a geek. Don't forget he's an avatar character. <laughs> Art glass, reading tarot cards and solar power. That sounds a... Could he be... is a hippie. We've already revealed it. Oh, yeah. So let's go on a date. Okay. They're like... They're both They're not horoscopes as well. Well, he's a mushroom farmer. She'd like that. Oh. She's a taxi driver, so he won't be that. <laughs> he won't be very impressed with but that. But their star signs match up. Yes. Because they're hippies. Yeah, I just said that. <laughs> Did you? Yeah. I wasn't paying attention. No, you don't normally, do you? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let's see. Oh, look, they've got matches there as well. Look, these two are made for each other. She doesn't use a plate, and she likes heavy metal music secretly. But we don't know what his is. No. His are, though. No. But anyway. So we're definitely going for that. Him, yes, we're going to go for him. He, he looks like a kind of uh, a toned down hippie, he's not a total hippie. You know what we forgot to... Oh no, we haven't forgotten, it's alright, we can still do it. Do what? I forgot to look at the Chinese one. A what star? Oops. Oh, oh, oh look, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a snazzy one. Peking Toms. Right. What are we well, going to do? He's a two star. He so... likes black hair, so we're going to change her hair to black. Using the newfangled system. Then we are going to. They're both hippies. Both hippies. I suspect she looks like a hippie, yes. Hippie, she's already a hippie. Hippie, yes. And hippie. hippie. Right. So she's already perfect. Yes. 
Now just he's buy him a... two stars, so we could get him a little gift. We might have some juggling Gee. balls in the cupboard. Yeah. Flore oh no, we've no. got any fluorescent green mankinis. <clears throat> no, we haven't got any juggling balls. Oh yes, you have, have you? No, no, you haven't. We've got. We could give him a, so a skipping rope. Would he like that? No. Probably not. These are expensive. They are kind of expensive. It's because they're popular. The more expensive something is, the more likely it is to please them. An ethnic beaded necklace. Oh yes. No, that's for ladies, apparently. Only in the game. Anyone can wear an ethnic beaded necklace. In real life, yes. yeah. Um, what about a reclaimed wood phone case? Well, that's for hipsters. Pink cowgirl hat? No, that's for glam. Oh. Let's just not bother. All right, then. Oh, we could give him a cute animals character. Let's <laughs> a calendar. Let's try that. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Just It'll be show. funny. <laughs> just, uh, it's an experiment. Glam types love bling, excess, and celebrity-related stuff. OMG. Here we are. How exciting. Are we going to buy everything on the menu? Okay. You must be Elise. Pleased to meet you. You'll be bang on time. I don't like people waiting as well as wanky, doesn't it? Only the best for you. Your hair's a nice shade of dark brown. Tell very much. Your hair's nice and black, eh? Thanks, I'm glad you like it. I bought you something nice. Oh, what a strike of light. What a lovely surprise. Is he going to like it, though? Bing. Oh, it's blooming oh, brilliant. Oh, he very wow. much. Because he's a hippie. He likes animals. Oh, yeah. Cute animals. That yeah. went down well. <laughs> I wasn't expecting oh. that. Good evening. Are you ready to order? Yes, please. What would you like? I think something hot with no meat. Because he's also a vegetarian. He's a hippie. Hot Hippies are always no meat. Right, we'll pay for those three. Right, hot with no meat. I think hot with no meat. Five fish. No, that's fish. Yu Sheng. No. Oh, no, it's cold. That's got pig in it. That looks like, no, it's got to be that one then. Tender pieces of frog. Stinky oh. tofu, it really does stink. Two portions of stinky tofu, please. The chef's speciality. Great, it sounds lovely. Have you it ever, does, doesn't it? Have you ever actually smelled that Oh, Kitty, that stuff? you're quite the gourmet. Sorry, what? Have you ever actually smelt that stinky tofu? No, I'd rather not, thanks. No, you're better off It not. looks like something from under your toenails. It's worse than that. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a lot worse. Right, we've got two matches here. So we, should we pay to reveal a new one, or should we go with the safe option but spend ten coins? Um, uh, go with the re reveal the tradition. Because reveal. In case it goes horribly wrong and then we've at least gained something. Yeah. I'm when not... picking a holiday, would you prefer somewhere you've been before or somewhere new and exotic? Oh, hang on, let me think. Somewhere new yes, and exotic. it was worth what it. What about you then? I'd have to say something new and exotic. We're all technoed up, ain't we? Yeah, spot on. <laughs> Dinner is served. <laughs> Time to pull the love handle. Interests, activity, interests. Should we do interests? Then? Yeah, I think we can safely So I've interests. heard you're interested in art glass. Art, art glass. glass that's more yeah, art. I flipping that's... love art glass. She I likes it. it. She don't love it. No, because art glass is arty people, really. Yeah. It's alright as it goes, isn't it? <laughs> so what do you like doing? She likes stargazing. Yeah, who doesn't? I really like stargazing. That sounds well good, doesn't it? It is actually. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Right, who are we going to shoot? Click him because he's two star. Okay. We haven't lied yet either. No, that's good. So that's a good tactic. If you think you're going to have to lie a lot, shoot the person who's lying, the clients. And if you haven't lied much, or if someone's got a lot more uh, affluence level, the more star rating, they need to be shot with the love in the face. That's right. I'm just going to pop outside and make a phone call. Okay. <laughs> Right, oh, it's a power cut, I think. Yes. Oh, oh it's a power cut. What's going on? I can't see a blooming thing in it. <laughs> what am I going to do now? It's him, look, he's Whoa. got glasses on. It's not a very hard game, that one. To no, be honest. it's not really a challenge, is it? And this is the hard restaurant as well. Oh, great, the power's back on. She was finding me. I was well lost, weren't I? <laughs> oh, no worries. Glad you made it back. <laughs> Bless them. It's so crap. Oh, 
There we go, we're back over 200. Give me your hands, all right, you can see. <laughs> Time for the love handle. Right, what have we got? We've got facial decor, which uh, we haven't spoken about that, have we? Um, and hairstyle. Let's go uh, hairstyle. Um, I don't think his hair you. is no, very hippie -ish. Is really He doesn't hippie. really look like a hippie. He doesn't actually, no. no. Is he an avatar character? Probably. That's why he doesn't look like a hippie. I see. So let's go for interests. Okay. Because we, we can't go wrong. I heard you're interested in. Solar power. Solar power? Yeah, I think love solar power. <laughs> what a distracting distraction. That sounds really exciting. Yeah, it's well good, eh? What do you like doing? I like herb gardens. That sounds well good, doesn't it? It does, actually. <laughs> Hello, I do hope you enjoyed your meal. Perhaps you might care for some of our handcrafted chocolate. Ooh, not handcrafted yes, chocolate. Yes, handcrafted. Ooh, I love it. Handcrafted <laughs> chocolate. Oh, what do you like? Think. Would you like a chocolate? A handcrafted chocolate? Ooh, I'd love a handcrafted chocolate. Mm. Oh, go on then. You twisted me arm. Give me three yummy ones. I gotta tell you though, I think fudge surprise ones are disgusting. <laughs> and I love orange enchantment, don't I? Right. <laughs> Pick one of the middle ones. Okay. Why is that, Alan? Because they'll, you'll get more information about what's around them. Oh yeah. Right. So, no. Ooh, oh, he didn't like Flood Surprise. Oh. This is the hard reason, so there'll be a lot of Flood Surprise. There's going to be a lot of Flood Surprise around. Right, there's a lot of... Bad there's ones. no good ones, in fact, around there. So the good one must be here somewhere. You may as well pick one of the three on the right-hand column. Is it? Ooh, yes. it's Orange Enchantment, isn't it? It's, it's all time favourite. Oh, well done. Right, so there's three bad ones around there. Oh, now, that no. one has to be bad because they share it. I reckon all three of these are bad. I'm going to go with that one. Okay. Oh, yes. it's Honeycomb Joy. That was quite good. Two of them are well nice, eh? Cheers for that. Oh, no problem. We seem to have similar chocolate tastes. And you got my favourite flavour and all. That was good. My bed's calling me. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> I really like them. Should we go for it? Yeah. Yeah. Will you go out with me? Do you want to get more serious? <laughs> no, oh, if you want me over, be charm, ain't ya? <laughs> oh, this is the best feeling ever. Let's see if it lasts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how mean. Kitty, you are mean. But realistic. But realistic, yes. Don't have very high expectations, you'll never be disappointed. <laughs> no, wow, he loves her. Look, I might quite pop the question, innit? Oh my goodness. Oh, you don't really did see that. Did we shoot him with working. Cupid, though? We did shoot him. We did Cupid. shoot him with love. Right so he's place. got an artificially high, high level yeah. of love yeah. because of all that love dripping that off him. Extra juice dripping down his face. <laughs> Alan, please. <laughs> right, are we going to go? Oh, we didn't go up a level. Anyway. So I think that's the end of this uh, episode of Master Dates. Is it? We've done two. Yes, dates, yes. We? we did a spectacular match there. Uh, we'll next time we'll probably poke some characters if we can remember to do it this time. We didn't see the cat this episode either, um, but we did buy some menu items and we did see an achievement in the first date. So anyway, we'll see you next time. Don't forget to buy the game if you haven't got it already. KittyPowersMatchmaker.com. And uh, if you haven't downloaded the update yet, which you saw some of the features of, you uh, yes, you can download that now on all platforms. And also, don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you've got any requests for future episodes, place them in the comments below, please. Keep them clean, kittens. Bye-bye. Say goodbye, Alan. Bye, Alan. Bye. <laughs>